One, two, three, four. Healthy snacks on the go, dancing at the studio, fueling our bodies the right way. Energy for exercise, feeling good, you'll be surprised. Food to go with Steph and Roe. High five. <laughs> Welcome to Food to Go with Steph and Roe. Today's tasty summer treat is a watermelon slushy. Oh, yes. I'm so excited for this one. <laughs> the ingredients you'll need are watermelon, honey, and ice cubes. The tools you'll need are a cutting board and a knife, or an ice cream scooper, and a blender. This is actually a really easy treat to make. Uh, the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to put about approximately six ice cubes, give or take, into a blender, mm -hmm. and then oh. you're going to blend it. Ready? Oops. Plug your ears. Blended to you? Uh, absolutely. I mean, I hit the ice crush button. Absolutely. Easy. <laughs> cool. And then we've gone ahead and made two cups of watermelon chunks. Yep. I like to do it with the ice cream scoop because I just think it's mm -hmm. way easier. You don't have to get cutting board dirty. You just scoop it out and go. It's super easy. Yeah, definitely. Especially when you have a release button on your ice cream scooper. We're so lucky. Yeah, we live a, a good life. Yeah. A good life, a charmed life, the food to go folks. <laughs> Watermelons are a great summer treat because. They are, not surprisingly, filled with water. Yeah, they're a thirst water. quencher, all right. They're a thirst quencher, and they're going to help hydrate your body really well. So Yeah, also fill you with some vitamin A, vitamin C, and lycopene. We've learned about that before. Mm, if, it's, if it's red at all in color, it's probably got lycopene. Maybe. Good for old thumper. <laughs> and then we're going to do a little scorch of honey. All in right. This red. Yeah, I don't really know that you are a good... <laughs> Scorcher. Judge of scorching, what a, what a scorch is. I mean, I've made one mistake. Uh, sometimes honey takes a long, like, <laughs> that's that's honey's deal. It's slow. Honey yeah. Is, well, we should have had this bear on its head Yeah. the, the whole time, but we didn't. Yeah. We let him stand up straight. Yeah. Um, so you're going to take one scorch of honey. Technically, the recipe calls for one teaspoon, but I, I don't like to get things dirty. So I'm just going to do like a little squirt, if yeah. I, when it'll let me. So. I'm just going to guess. And but I will say our guesses are a little different. She always errs on the side of not as much, and I, I generally will put more of whatever sweetener in there. Uh-uh, uh-uh. How do we cut? Uh, cut. Can cut that out? No, it's fine. No, we'll <gasps> see. Okay, so what we do is now we've got our scorch of honey, our two cups of watermelon, and our ice, and... No hair. Definitely no hair in this recipe. <gasps> Okay, so as you may have seen, you, you'll probably need to stir it just a couple of times, especially in the beginning. Yep. But then you've got yourself a real nice slush, and you do want to make sure that you use um, a seedless watermelon. The little white guys won't really interfere, uh, but the big, the big seeds, if you get a seeded watermelon, might go down a little rough. Yeah, yeah, and then you'll grow a watermelon plant in your stomach. What am I thinking that? That'll be totally awkward. It's so awkward in dance class. <laughs> yeah. So. I think it's more like watermelon juice. No, watermelon slush. And if you wanted it to be slushier, you could probably add more ice. But this is like a better option. Huh. I'll probably make more in the future. You know what I mean? Yeah. Okay. Okay. So maybe three or four cups if you're serving two. Totally. Two teaspoons of honey and uh, two scorches of honey. 12 to 15 ice cubes. Just double the recipe. Yeah. It's fine. It's perfect. <laughs> but this is a great alternative instead of like going to 7-Eleven and getting oh a Slurpee, which is uh, probably going to rot your insides. Oh my gosh. Just have a good, high quality like, watermelon <laughs> slushy. Absolutely. And you can tell 7-Eleven we said that. Yeah. Sorry about that. No, we're not sorry. At all. Right? Maybe they should maybe yeah. they'll carry this recipe. Maybe. We'll let them know. Woo! Thanks for watching. Have a healthy week. Wow. Oh. That's really good. Man.